Oh, I don't know why I'm so sleepy. All right. So requested it, and I'm also curious. So let us just start. The Young reading. The Young's love story. Okay. Um, he's going to deal with a woman. He he's he's dealing with a woman. We we haven't start. <laughs> we haven't start and this card is the only one that is flip. Look. We haven't start yet. <laughs> you know what card it is? It's the lovers. And bottom of the deck is two of fire, twin flame. We're, we're gonna see because uh, for all this time I've been asking Taehyung, do you have a twin flame? And the answer always between yes and sometimes no, sometimes yes, sometimes no. Yeah, I think I think I want to know first about the friends, but he emphasized on the ends. In, in the past, he published a song with Jimin duet, well, on the same title, Friends, right? And the lyric is saying that you're my soulmate, right? You're my soulmate. But now he's publishing a song called Friends, but he emphasized on the end. I was wondering if it has anything to do with Jimin or not. Yeah. Uh, um, I know it's gonna publish on 15 March, but I just wanna do this for fun only. I just wanna take a guess. What is this about? Is that song about Jimin? Okay, is that song Friends of Peace single Friends has anything related to Friends his duet song with Jimmy? Okay, thank you. Yeah, quick answer by Pendulum. My partner in crime says that it has nothing to do with Jimin or the song Friends that he did with Jimin. Okay. Now let us just draw a little. What is that song about? The friends. Why did he make that song? Why did he make that song? Because transformation. The death. Okay. And what is that song about? Two cards show up. The car, uh, the it, the song is about King of Pentacle. Uh, it's definitely saying something about goodbye. It's goodbye. Okay, I. You know what? I'm gonna pull three cards about the question. What is the song is about? I don't think King of Pentacles is an enough explanation. There's a story behind it. Ten of Wands. What's the song is about? The world. Okay, something ends. The song is about uh, this. I forgot my question. <laughs> I forget my question, honestly. But, uh, yeah. Uh, trans the death. The death. This, it's, it's about transformation. Yeah. Also, this is the world. Okay. It's about transformation. Probably from the Ten of Wands to this King of Pentacles. So I think this is like uh, his own personal growth, right? I think this is about his personal growth because uh, among all of these cards, it's like uh, it doesn't tell us about someone or some community, but it's like a personal growth. Especially with his King of Pentacles. It's like he's saying goodbye to his old self. Okay. It, it's definitely about something ending. Something ends and he puts his expression into the song. What is the thing that he left behind? He left behind this.
Okay, clarify about this Ace of Cups. Six of Cups. Six of Yeah, yeah, yeah. His old self. His old self. Right. There's uh, like it's a journey. It's his own personal journey. Something like that. And he left behind whatever whatever built him in his childhood times. Oh, if I know Taehyung personally, I'm I bet I know what this is was. But since I don't know him personally, so yeah, to me, to me, this is about a personal journey, his own personal journey. It's not about someone, it's not about lover, it's not about heartbreak. Yeah, okay, wait. Why he used the title friends? Why did he use the title friends? A friend of us. Yes, Ace of Wands, yes. Yeah, this is personal journey, guys. Yeah, probably in the lyric he's gonna say that I'm saying goodbye to you, goodbye, but uh, to me this is like a personal journey. Uh, like he find himself growing after knowing what's not working. That is uh, coming from the place where he was uh, grow up in. Uh, an example, you probably born from your parents, but you're not them, right? You're your own human being, right? An example, um, me today, I'm probably the child of my dad and my mom, but in the past life, they could probably be my children. I am the parents, they are the children, could be. And probably on the next life, could be that my grandmother in this current life can be my parents. They can also be my nephew, right? And so therefore, your child, child probably coming from you, but they are not you. When we were born, we are just like an empty paper uh, in which our parents are ready to put something on that paper to uh, to make it have a, a sense of identity, right? Sometimes the identity that your parents uh, write, wrote, wrote on that paper, it's not really matched with the, your true self. Sometimes uh, your parents' idea might work for them, but not gonna work for you. It could be for so many reasons. One, because you have different uh, personality than your parents and different personality requires a different approach in the life trouble that is in coming to your way right and then the second is because as you age society also age right society also growing right maybe 50, 50 five decades ago we don't have smartphones we don't have YouTube People are going to office to make money and then they go home and feed their children. But today, there's an Android. We have smartphones. Everybody is connected to one another. So there's some job that um, hum uh, there's some job that is going extinct and there is a new job that is occurring, right? In the past life, there's a, uh, people who knocking on other people's store every morning will get money and feed their family with that money. Uh, with that new social dynamic, it's gonna require you to grow up as a different person than your parents. And so therefore, it is very normal that if you find that your parents' situation is no longer work for you, and so you need to transform. Yeah, you have to transform is a form of adaptation so you can survive your life, right? And when you have a child one day, that child is also going to grow up 
and they're going they're going to left you behind to be the person who they are meant to be in order to face their life's challenge that probably are not going to align with uh, what works for you right now and this is how I see it okay that is the idea I'm leaving my old self and it seems like with ten of ones it seems like there is a healing from his heart like uh, I no longer want to Okay, okay, okay. Let's let's clarify this first. Clarify this one of ones, please. What is this about? How? In what way he feel burden? In what way he feel burden? Thank you. Mm. In what way he feel burden? Four of Pentacles. Ten of Wands. Mm, okay, I see. So uh, this is this is speaking in one tone, right? They are speaking together like this, right? So it's like easiest way to explain this is um, okay. I'm I'm gonna use example, but you have to be remember this is just example. This is not my channeling. This is example to just to uh, to help you to understand what it is like right uh, I'm gonna use a romance based example it doesn't have to be romance but a romantic example is the easiest way to explain this combination I think this song is about like uh, an example uh, you have a lover in a past you have a boyfriend or girlfriend and then you break up with this person and that person is already move on. Probably they already married someone else. But you still here stay stuck with this feeling. Like, I still love you. I still think about you. I cannot let move on. I cannot let go. I cannot forget you. I cannot get rid of you of my mind. And, and so it become a burden to your heart, right? Be it become a burden because this emotion where you cannot move on from is a, a start to transforming into an energy that is always be with you that is always following you around yeah just like a friend so you make friend with this energy although it is not something that makes you happy but it's always there like a friend now that you have moved on right you become this king of pentacle you already uh, release all this burden and you're ready to face a new love, a new uh, romantic situation. You're, you finally move on from these uh, friends and you become this king of pentacle and that is how it is end. I think that is the story, okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm scared now if this prediction is not going to come true. Please don't <laughs> I, I'm gonna I'm gonna prepare some barricades and shields and barrier from attackers if this if I guess it wrong. <laughs> so, okay. You you must know that it's I'm kind of scared to publish this because what if I'm wrong? Uh, however, this can also work as a career situation in a way that uh, probably the old way he make money is uh, for the wrong reason, right? I make money because I want to have, uh, I want to provide my family. An example. So you gotta do whatever you want to do. Uh, even though uh, you didn't like the job, you keep doing it anyway just because you want money because you want to take care of someone because you have responsibilities, right? But something happens and you had grow to be someone better and so you're closing up that cycle where you feel burdened when you try to make money to more like uh, inspired 
you're from now on i'm not gonna make song make music just because it is something popular just because it is predicted as um it's going to be liked by everyone but i don't like doing it i'm gonna choose my heart i'm gonna uh i'm gonna do what i inspired to do and i therefore i'm closing up the si that cycle of my life right so from now on things are changing i'm gonna make money from my heart so that friend is ending now because situation is changed uh okay that is pretty much what have what i get from the card combination if i guess it wrong please be kind to me <laughs> i'm just a human i make mistake <laughs> all right uh now i'm gonna add this this video and upload it and i'm gonna proceed to do the hughes love situation with this queen of pentacle who the fuck is that woman kim tae hyung